Most of us are familiar with slugs, like this one. Small, grey, white, slimy things, found when rock or wood laying in a damp place is turned over. But there are others, like this one. Linus maximus, the leopard slug, one of the larger members of the group. Named because of its spots and stripes, it is an introduced species, up to 150 millimetre long, mostly nocturnal, these must have been late getting home, as I spotted them early in the morning. Their eyes are on the two larger antenna, and the hole visible a little further back is their breathing pore. Together with snails, it is a mollusk, and has a remnant shell or shield mantle visible just back from its head. The slug's underline is an extended muscular foot, which exudes a slimy mucus, which paradoxically is both a lubricant and an adhesive. The mucus allows the slug to move smoothly over surfaces and even stick to vertical ones. The leopard slug is a hermaphrodite, male and female in one. After mating, its jelly-like eggs are laid in a dark, damp spot. These were exposed while moving a dog kennel and the developing slug can be seen in the eggs. When threatened, it behaves like its snail relatives in that it retracts the head, tentacles and body under the remnant shell. I guess this offers some protection and presents a smaller target. As well, it is able to secrete a watery mucus, which might make it less appetising to a predator. Like all of them, they are an impressive animal. To ensure that no one falls asleep watching this video, I've speeded up the motion bits. It is intriguing to watch the slug glide seemingly without moving, like a ship on the sea, leaving behind a smear of slime in its wake. 